What happened to 50-year-old Peretz Sontag? Once again today, volunteers took to the air over Rockland and Orange counties in search of the car driven by the Rockland father. He has been missing for seven days now. The Hudson Valley businessman vanished, but the efforts to find him are still in full swing and have now expanded into Westchester. As News 12's Robert Wolf tells us tonight, volunteers are still hopeful that Sontag will be found alive. Chopper 12 was overhead Thursday as, once again, volunteers took to the air in search of Perrette Sontag. This time, volunteers took off in a helicopter from Orange County, flying over Stony Point and Harriman State Park, areas where pings from Sontag's cell phone were last detected. They also flew over portions of the Catskills. The ground search itself expanding to Westchester County in the search for the father of seven, missing since last Friday. We're thanking everybody for all their time and efforts. Michael Greenfield of Wesley Hills helping to coordinate the search on the ground. We took Rockland County and we divided it into five towns. We went through the four towns that we have and created 200 grids. So we had over 200 volunteers that went out yesterday. Today we're continuing with that last town and moving on to the next county towards the ping locations. When one of us is in pain, one of us is hurting, we help out. Israel Cohen of Wesley Hills doesn't know Perrette Sontag, but this is his fourth trip out to help. He, along with hundreds of others, have been handing out flyers like these in that grid search, this time at gas stations in Spring Valley. I hope we find him. I hope we find him and he's okay. And, you know, I could just hope for the best. You, you know, you know, you don't know what's going to happen, so you just pray to God that it's all going to be good. The focus continues to be on Sontag's black 2012 Kia Optima sedan, New York license plate number FZD8413, the car he was driving when he went missing. We want everyone searching as much as they can for that vehicle. The effort to find this father of seven continues on the ground and in the air. We're in Suffern, Robert Wolf News 12. And tonight, the family of Perrette Sontag is still offering a $30,000 reward for anyone with information leading to his safe return home.